Many enterprise companies are currently using legacy business intelligence, or BI, and looking to move to the cloud. However, there are a lot of concerns around the migration to the cloud and losing insights gained from their BI. They also want to enable their employees to have direct insights into their line of business, as well as enabling them to quickly react to changes in their data. This demo will show you how you can enrich your custom website with the data visualization and business intelligence components of Oracle Analytics Cloud, or OAC. We are going to show you how a company who is currently using business intelligence dashboards in their custom website can benefit from the new features of data visualization in OAC. Some of you may have used legacy BI before, but for those who haven't, there are some concerns around embedding visualizations into your custom website and keeping them interactive and look modern. Now let's look at a company who is currently embedding business intelligence dashboards inside their custom website. As you can see, they are wanting to keep their drill down functionality they currently have, as well as modernize the look and feel of their website and have more control over the visualizations from their application. To solve this, we have decided to migrate to the Oracle Analytics Cloud. This customer has decided to replicate their on-premise database into an Oracle Autonomous Data Warehouse, or ADW, but they also could have chosen to connect directly to their on-premise database. Now we will look at how to make a connection from ADW to OAC. Here we are at the homepage of OAC. To start off, we're gonna click the Create button, choose Connection, and then select Oracle Autonomous Data Warehouse Cloud. We will just name our connection, select our client credentials, and add the username and password. After the connection is created successfully, we are going to create a new project from the data set. To save time, we have already created a project from our data set. We can use the inbuilt functionality of explain in OAC to quickly find graphs that we would like to embed into our website. If we go over to key drivers of termination reason, we can see that we have a termination reason by department that we would like to include in our custom website. Simply by selecting the check mark and hitting add selected, we can see the visualization populate on the canvas. If we would like to change the graph type, we simply hit this drop down and select a new type. We would also like to be able to have selections made from our visualizations available to our custom website. To accomplish this, we will go over to this menu, select data actions, and create a new data action. We want the type to be publish event, and we will name it filter reason. We will anchor it to the filter reason attribute of our data, and we will just give it a name of, again, filter reason. This will allow selections made in the graphs available to our JavaScript application. The last thing we want to do to embed the visualization into our custom website is click this menu, go to Developer, and then go to the Embed tab. Simply by adding this script to the beginning of our website and using the Oracle DV tags wherever we want the visualization to show up, we can successfully embed this visualization into our website. Now we can see the updated web page after migrating to the Oracle Analytics Cloud. We can see that we have updated data visualization graphs as well as our business intelligence dashboard that we previously had. We still have the functionality to be able to drill down into department as well as the ability to filter based on department and have that drive all visualizations on the dashboard. Because we added a data action, we can also use the graphs to make selections. If we wanted to filter all visualizations based on the termination reason, we can simply right click, hit filter reason, and we will again see all graphs update. To start with, the customer has their on-premise data. They're using Oracle Business Intelligence to embed dashboards into their custom website. To start the migration, they first move over their on-premise database into an autonomous data warehouse. Next, they migrate the Oracle Business Intelligence over to Oracle Analytics Cloud. Then they are able to create new visualizations with the data visualization component and embed those into their custom website. Now that we have successfully migrated, we no longer need the on-premise business intelligence. Through this demo, we have gone over the benefits of migrating to the Oracle Analytics Cloud. 
We have shown how you can quickly create new visualizations and embed them in your custom website. We have also shown how you can use existing BI dashboards and integrate those with new visualizations for a seamless user experience.